There is no reason anymore not to run Windows 10 Pro retail version on your PC, get it now $12.50 only, instant delivery on a brand new secured web store. Hello, hello and welcome to this new part of Let's Play Skyrim Special Edition, the 2021 Ultimate Graphics Edition. Um, and as always, of course, based on the Skyrim 2021 Ultimate Graphics Tutorial. So if you want to have my these same graphics, make sure you follow the links in this video to uh, do the tutorial, check out mod lists, etc, etc. So anyway, uh, the last time we arrived here at Riften, we did a first couple of quests and now we um, need to talk with this guy because we need to steal something because he will start a, a distraction and then we need to put it at someone's pocket. So it's probably not going to be uh, um, easy. So I would say that's quick save and let's see what he has to say to us. Okay, lad. Ready to make some coin. Do you want me to... You're going to have to sneak over to Medesi's stall and use... Then, when you have the ring, you pick pocket branche. Okay. Good. Wait until I start the distraction. Then show me what you're made of. Everyone. Working at the Rift in Fishery is tough. I, to I have some something coin. amazing to show you that demands your attention. You need to hear this. Okay, let's be careful. Okay, then this should do it. Okay. Okay, let's find the correct position. Yep. Okay, let's uh, quick save as well. And now we need to plant the ring. see the ring if we're able to do that um or is it is it gonna work you guys think don't even think it. looks like i chose the right person for the job and here you go your payment uh-huh just as i promised the way things have been going around here it's a relief that our plan went off without a hitch yeah my organization's been having a run of bad luck, but I suppose that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You did the job, and you did it well. Best of all... Sure. All right, then. Let's put that to the test. The group I represent has its home in the Ratway beneath Riften, a tavern called the Ragged Flagon. Yeah, the Get there in one right? piece, and we'll see if you really got... Oh, yeah, it's like a dungeon of itself, if I'm not mistaken. So, okay. Okay, let's see the quest we do have now, currently. Oh, crap. Quest, so... Taking care of business, yeah. So what does the map say? Do we still have something to do in Riften? Yeah, it's here, that is to... Uh, locate Brain Wolf at the Ragged Flagon. So that means we need to go um, down here. Where is it? That's right. It isn't yours. You're under arrest, Branche. This is insane. I didn't steal anything. I never saw this ring before in my entire life. We can do this one of two ways. You can walk with me up to see you again. I can drag your lifeless body. Your choice. But I've very well. Legendary and that's unfortunate for him. Yeah, that's just how it is. Okay, let's see how we can get here downstairs. Looks there's a staircase here, which is a good thing. 
Let's see, did I activate the timer? Yes, I did. Okay. So, like I said in the previous part, I will uh, now make sure to uh, make my parts 30 minutes long because I think 20 to 25 minutes is just a little bit too short for this. Wow, it looks good here, you know? The water, the reflection of the sun. I think it's not, uh, not looking too bad. But, yeah, we have a job to do. We need to go to... Um, to infiltrate here in the Thieves Guild. So there's an entrance here somewhere, I guess. What is this place? Oh, it's uh, Alchemist. That means we can maybe create I'm some potions. Busy, but if you need any pot you here for lessons like Ingen? Well, the moisture in the air is better for the ingredients. It isn't every day that you get your hands on fresh hmm? urn. True then. It also makes it easier to gather water when the canal. Besides, I also prefer the quiet. I didn't open this business for browsing. Hardly. In fact, I don't know how I get anything done with all the distractions I have to put up with. My wife, Half York, well, she's a necessary evil. Uh, then there's Ingen Blackbriar. Bright young thing and a worthy apprentice. <laughs> okay. She... So let's see what Spells he has for sale. And incantations. For those with the talent to cast them. So he also um, sells ingredients, it seems. Let's buy potions of healing and stamina. All right, and for the rest, <coughs> I think we're good. Maybe we want to buy the wheat because I know um, we can use it to create healing potions. And the vampire dust for invisibility potions. Yes, yes, goodbye. Hello. Hmm? I'm aspiring to earn that title, yes. However, the road ahead is paved with loose cobbles and deadly pitfalls. Master Elgrim says I'm a natural, that I have a unique talent. But I fear his approval masks. My errant formulas have cost Master Elgrim a fortune in ingredients, some of which are almost irreplaceable. To restore Master Elgrim's supply, oh man, no, <laughs> I'm not going to do that. This place has seen ghosts. I swear, if I wasn't around, in fact, I need to arrange for someone to pick up an ore sample for me in Shore Stone. Sure, I'll do it. You would speak to Filnyar in Shore Stone. He's got okay, some okay, okay, okay. So, um, let's see. By the way, look how nice the quality of the texture here looks. Also for the fireplace. I think that's uh, really adding the immersion um, factor. Yeah. You look pretty. So I just wanted to look at your face. But we are here for serious business, and that is creating potions. <clears throat> so the first one is restore health. And restore magic potion. Apparently we can create... And let's use all of the other ingredients here. Okay, <laughs> that's a good uh, thing to waste ingredients. Um, okay, yeah, we are not here for... Um, we were originally here down here for the Thieves Guild. So let's see, what does the local map say I need to go? That's here to the red way. There, that's where we need to go. I thought it was here somewhere at ground level, right? Okay. Oh, here it is. Okay. All right. Let's uh, prepare ourselves for um, some combat. Because I know from the last time we were uh, being attacked here. Uh, let's also make sure that we do not have all the other quests activated. It's a little bit um, disturbing. So, what is our quest actually? Yeah, okay. We need to... Let's just leave these two quests on. And let's see what we will find here. I hear all kinds of sounds. They'd skin us alive if they knew we were Hey you, this. stop right there. Empty your pockets or end up as skiva food. <laughs> yeah, what are you going to do? Brynjolf's been sending idiots like you. 
funny thing is his stupid thieves guild net. Now empty your pockets or I'll pick the gold off your corpse. Piss off. No need to get hasty. I I was just testing you. You can go on ahead. Let him go, Hunan. All clear. Get him. Kill him. Yeah, I'm right. going to kill him anyway. Let's uh, see what these guys have with them. Because his bow looks good. Yeah, he has a dwarf bow, so that's why I wanted to kill him. I was hoping he has something of value. Okay. Yeah, we're not going to take any um, risks with this. If you, uh, if some of you watched Breaking Bad by chance, um, there's this episode where Mike Ermintrout explains a little bit about uh, uh, what is it, health measures, and I think that's been done very well and made a lot of impression on me. Um, you know where, you, uh, yeah, the thing is where, what what happens if you take health measures. So, if you haven't watched that, make sure to watch that clip. It's pretty uh, pretty explained very well. So that's what I would like to do as well. I don't want to make sure I don't want to use any health measures when playing Skyrim. Okay, not sure about this, but let's just uh, clear this. What a dwarven arrow. Hmm. It's a little bit too expensive. And let's switch back to the dwarven arrows. It's not that there are any un oh. skeevers. Who is attacking me? Okay, <laughs> I have no idea what that was, but. Was weird. Who is uh, attacking me? Oh, are these stupid uh, bear traps? Okay, that was pretty random. It's uh, hard to see here, so we have to be careful for these bear traps. expecting trouble okay okay let's go back to the shield because we have plenty of light here it seems what do we have here an iron battle X with some butterflies and some flowers we can pick That's a pretty good description for this guy. Okay, he killed some skeevers. An iron dagger, okay. All good. Ah, here's the wreck flagon. Here's where it came for, I think. Okay, let's uh these are the guys from the Thieves Guild. So let's not draw any unwanted attention. I'm telling you, this one is different. Uh huh. We've all heard that one. Well, well. Call me a press line. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. Ah, uh, for sure. Reliable and headstrong? You're turning out to be quite the prize. So, now that I've whetted your appetite with our little scheme at the market, how about handling a few deadbeats for me? They owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. 
Sure. Kidava, Percy Honeyhand, and Helga. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. Okay. Honestly, the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't to be ignored. A word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. Okay, Bad okay, okay. Business. Good. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. Kirava's stubborn, but she's got a soft spot for family. Talk to Tal and Jay at the B and Bar and see if you can get something out of him. They're well acquainted, if you catch my meaning. Sure. Helga is a devout follower of Debella and dotes over the statue to the divine that she keeps at the bunkhouse. Use it as leverage and she'll cave. All right, sounds good. He's as pig headed a man as you'll ever find. The key is that ugly dwarven urn in his shop. Smash that thing to bits and he'll change his attitude. Sure, that sounds I'll be here good. When you're done. You'd better have coin to pay for your drinks. I do have coin. Uh, let's see what he has for sale. Nah, just some uh, different Until stuff. Until next time. Stay out of trouble, or there's gonna be tr Mall? Yeah. That jerk works for Maven Blackbriar now. I guess he's better at all that talking stuff anyway. I just mess everything up. Okay. Until next time. So this is Vex. I'm busy. Don't you have something to do? Yep, I do have. If you're looking for conversation, the flagon is in the place. Ah, I suppose I can work with your face. After all, the sculptor cannot always choose the finest clay. Okay. Yes, I once practiced my art in the salons and manners of Tamriel's great and good. Now the scum of Skyrim are my only clients. But no matter, the greatest artists are never recognized in their own time. So, are you here as a client? Shall I remake your face? Uh, no. <laughs> Indeed. It is no small thing to submit yourself to the flesh sculptor's knife. Change it. I can remake your face. I do not practice my art for free, however. I doubt you can afford this. Yeah, you can just, like, you type in the, uh, command in, um, in the console, you know, the, uh, what is it? The character change come on. I think Brynjolf could give you stick with me and he'll never even Let's see it's there. Okay, so okay we need to now um do that. We need to in intimidate some people. So let's um let's get out of here then. So I'm wondering what's the shortest route to all of this is. I hope this um compass is uh, is correct about this, that this is the shortest route. Ah, okay, now it is. Since I can activate the lever. For some reason, I always have the instinct to just double check a body to make sure I loaded everything, which is pretty uh, weird. But uh, yeah, let's get out of here and let's um, do that intimidation stuff. Oh, I do hear a dragon. Maybe that's why my control control rumble this one. You guys hear that as well? You're a dragon for sure. So let's see what we need to do. We need to do a couple of things. Good day, friend. You can well. Let's uh, check it out. Be a barb. Let's make a quick save just to be sure. What do you want? I met her when I wandered into Riften a few years ago. Been smitten with her ever since. Okay. In Lachmarsh, tradition dictates we present a potential mate a unique wedding ring to represent our future bond. I already have the gold band, but all I need... I was hoping you'd offer. I didn't think it was my... Pl Every Argonian wedding proposal band is supposed to have three... Two of the gems, the ones on the outside... The amethyst in the center represents the hist, the entity that all are going okay, to um, a sacred part yeah. of our... 
with the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. The last... Look, I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't mistake this as acceptance for what you do. Kirava has some family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. If you mention you know about it, she might just listen to you. Sounds just good. please don't harm anyone. I couldn't bear the thought. All right, thanks. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to attend to. Here for a room or something to drink? Show me some coin for it. No, and I never will. Now get out of my inn. How could you possibly uh -huh. know about... Please, my family means too much to me. Don't hurt them. Very well. Here, take this back to Brynjolf and tell him he'll have no more trouble from me. Sounds good. That sounds good. So that's one of the three depths we uh, end. But there's more. So we also need to go here. Hello, sir. What's this nice shop you have? If I had it, I'd pay. There's no need to do that. So, uh, what? Oh, it's one of you people. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother to show up himself any... Petty threats and fist-waving are not going... You demand payment for protection. Don't fool yourself. It's only a matter of time before you people are run out of... Likewise. Just now I have a lot to do. So I'm... No, don't I can't that. pay. I can't. This isn't no. happening. All right, I get it. I'll pay on time from now on. Just don't smash anything else. Smart answer. Take your gold and leave me in peace. Thank you. So what is yes here? More nice stuff. What are you doing that for? Okay, and now we have um, the last thing we need to check. Which is here. Hello, Helga. It's you. Please, don't hurt me. I know who you are. You've been terrorizing the entire city. Please, there's no need for that here. Message understood. Here, I even have the payment. That was easy. Okay, so um, let's uh, deliver the quest. Hopefully, uh, the CSSS Serious Thieves Guild member. Let's take the short route. Um, let's see, where do we need to go? Okay. So we need to get on the other side to get into the rat wave. I definitely hear a dragon, by the way, so I have really no idea if he is going to attack us once we uh, leave Riften. But since we are in a rat way, it's probably one of the safer places to be. There's literally nothing the dragon can do to uh, attack us here. Alright, we can use this uh, yeah, bridge now, since it has been lowered to have fast uh, entrance to uh, the Thieves' Guild. Do you guys think we can uh, defeat a dragon? I uh, have really no idea, to be honest. I don't... Th yeah. With some fire resist potions maybe, but dragon is still a dragon. It's pretty strong. Obviously. So, let's see. Let's um, have dinner with him. Now let's talk with him. So, job's done and you even brought the gold. Best of all, you did it clean. I like that. Dumping bodies and keeping the guards quiet can be expensive. Well done. And it would seem I owe you something in return. Uh-huh. Here you go. I think you'll find these quite useful. Hmm. Okay, thanks. Judging from how well you've handled those shopkeepers, I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. That's the spirit. Larceny's in your blood. The telltale sign of a practice thief. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. What's on your mind? We've run into a rough patch lately. 
but it's nothing to be concerned about. Tell you what, you keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Is that enough? Sure. What's pretty funny here also, sometimes these ingredients will jump a little bit up and down. Um, uh, there's something to do with with these uh, ball with items being put into a ball, so an actor is put in an actor, you know, and for some reason Skyrim or maybe Skyrim modded can't really handle that very well. So that's as you see it saw there, it will sometimes jump. And you also we also saw that at the um, what is it, the companions, they also have that they have this large table with all the food and all the stuff. There are no more questions. How about following me and I'll show you what we're all about. Yeah, sure, sounds good. Let's see what he has to tell us. Welcome to the cozy little family. I'm one of the lookouts for the guild. I watch Delvin's back. So we're now a guild member. That means we also can sleep here, if I'm not mistaken. Ah, look at this. The secret place behind the closet. That's nice. Lead the way, please. Let's uh, hide the uh, compass for a little bit more immersion. So we're going to be introduced here to the other guys. I guess so. No, sir. This is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. This better not be another waste of the guild's resources. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. You play by the rules, you walk away rich. You break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. What we say, when we say. Uh-huh. Do I make myself clear? Good, then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Wait a minute. You're not talking about Golden Bull, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work, so let him prove it. Golden Blow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Okay. Aren't you forgetting something? Grignol assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us when you're in. Welcome to the field. Well, thank you very much. Welcome to the family, lad. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin. So don't disappoint me. Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, and talk to Tunelia in the flagon. She'll mm. set you up with your new armor. Sure. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. They raise the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouth wood elf named Aragoth. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hives and clearing out the safe in the main house. Sounds good. The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Hi. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. Maven prefers that Arangoth remains alive, but if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, kill him. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. Okay. Golden Glow Estate brought in. And out of the clear blue, Arangoth stopped sending us. So we send in Vex to find out he's hired a bunch of mercenaries to guard the place. Aye. Arangoth sent the city guard packing and fortified the entire island. In fact, Vex barely made it out of there alive. They're built like small fortresses to resist the weather, but their one weakness is flame. Besides, 
Nothing tells the people of Ripton we mean business better than a huge column of smoke. Sounds good. I'll give you one good reason. Maven Blackbriar. Burn all the hives, and she'd have to import honey for Blackbriar metery, which would cut... We had an arrangement with Maven. We kept an eye on Golden Glow Estate to make sure the honey kept flowing. If the workers had a dispute, we'd rough them up. In return, Maven allowed us to extort Arangar and bring in a huge payout. Let me put it to you this way. Nothing happens in Riften without Maven's consent. One word from her, and you could spend the rest of the fourth era in prison. Okay, thank you. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take So what do we have here? What is this? First it's a warrior handle scheme. Not sure what that item is, but uh, let's try to find it out. I think this is, yeah, the looks have definitely been added by uh, some mods, but I'm not sure if this was originally in the game or not, these, um, these things. Okay. Don't you have better things to do than... I'd like to know why you're wasting time asking about it when you should already be on your way. Yeah, 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 okay. I wanted to say something to you. Pull up a chair, my friend. This... When I started out in this business, I wasn't real. I didn't mean to imply I was earning an honest living. Either. With my lock picking aptitude, I was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, it's blah. where a client pays you to get arrested. And you get thrown into a prison. Usually it's to free someone the client cares about. And sometimes, either way, the trick was in the escape. That's where my strengths came in. Well, as a jailbreaker, you work alone. No guilt to back you up. I do jobs for the Thieves Guild and the Dark Brotherhood, but if things mm. did, the last jailbreak I attempted failed. I was in, after that, I promised my, I don't know. I think I realized that out in the world, my skills would bring, killing someone in a jail is much easier than what the Dark Brotherhood did. I already knew Delvin. I asked if I could join up and that was that. Sounds good. Hey, hey, I want to talk to you. I joined up with them maybe 10 years ago. Small clan, maybe 20 men. Don't get me wrong, the first few years with that clan were some of the best years of my life. All the food I could eat, all the wine I could drink, and all the... We raided a caravan one spring. I think we... They didn't put up much of a fight. All that was left were the women and the children. Then the leader of our clan, Garthek. No. We usually let them go. I refused to do it, and Garthek ordered the clan to kill me as well. Luckily, I had made some friends. We tore each other to pieces. After it was over, those of us... I left his head on a pike at the wreckage of the caravan. Never okay, knew sounds good. came of the rest of the clan that survived. All right, thanks. So, yeah, um, we are a little bit over time already, so let's see if there are any... Um but what actually needs to be left done. Um, so what's the quest here? So we need to... Um, we also need to get a thief, Thieves Guild armor, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, that's what we want. Alright, so let's... Um, oh, hi, Uthgurt. <laughs> You're up and personal, it's all of a sudden. So let's see, we want to speak to Vex and the other, yeah. Thing is that we need to get our armor. But I th I'm not sure if they provide heavy armor. I think they only have light armor at the Thieves Guild, which is not really usable for us, to be honest. Hi, Vex. Before we begin, I want to make two things perfectly clear. One, I'm the best infiltrator this rat hole of a guild's got. So if you think you're here to replace me, you're dead wrong. And two, you follow my lead and do exactly as I say. No questions, no excuses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you I like. I've been getting sick of the pushovers that usually walk in here. I think you and I are going to get along just fine. Now, it's time to get your feet wet. And I don't want to waste a lot of time talking about anything but business. 
Okay. We're in a bad way down here. Who knows? Old Delvin thinks it's some kind of curse. I think he's crazy. If you want my opinion, I'd say it's just plain old. You can get out there and start making a name for us again. Make them start fearing us like they did long ago. And while you're at it, make a little uh -huh. bit of coin on the side. I handle the burglary, shell, sweep, and heist jobs. If you don't like that kind of work, talk to Delvin. He runs the more up close and personal job. One of the quickest ways to make some coin in Skyrim is if you're interested, make a point. What do you say? Sure. Here you go. Hope you don't muck it up. Back with good news, I trust? <laughs> yeah, I did. That wood elf's wit. He's a lot smarter. Can you believe that Fetcher had more than tripled the guard? There must have been eight. It was like he was daring us to come and get him. Well, there's an old sewer tunnel that dumps into the lake on the northwest side of the island. That's how I slipped in there. Should still be Sound unguarded. Good? Been a while since I've seen one of those. What you've got there is a stone of Baron Zaya. Not like that it isn't. The stone was pried off of Baron Zaya's ceremonial crown by a thief in order to cover his tracks. I think there were 24 in all. Most people keep them as a curiosity. Some of the guild members have tried to locate them over the years, but they haven't been six. Look, I only buy things I can turn around quickly for a profit. And no one wants tell you what, if you find the rest of them, talk to me again. Okay. Otherwise, all right. But if you get arrested, don't blame it on me. Yeah, look. Oh, we must level up to train more. Okay. First you take the job, now you don't even want it. Got plenty. Take your pick. Um... <clears throat> So, hi, Every sir. now and again, we like to, if that means breaking into the, feel like doing a bit of shopping, the guild way. Yep, sure. Fine. Here's everything you need to know. Okay, sound good. So yeah, we're pretty much well prepared for um, solitude. Pool. Okay. Um, to go uh, go on that mission to uh, burn those beehives and all. So we can either enter the old sewer or we can, I think, go full attack with these guys. So I'm not really sure what to do, but we're going to see that in our next part. So uh, let's see, we also could find, um, while we're still here, get the guild armor. It's armor, okay. Is that still here? Hmm. Let's see, from who do we need to get this? Tonilla, okay. She's somewhere here. Bring your fight. Let me guess. He just plucked you off the street and dropped you into the thick of things without telling you which way is up. Am I right? Uh lied to my face isn't going to win you any favors on the other hand taking some of these extra jobs off mine see that kind of attitude comes from someone who wants to get rich and stay alive long enough to enjoy it so if you've got the nerve i've got plenty of look around you the flagon the guild it's all falling apart a few decades ago this place was as busy as the imperial city now <laughs> You'd be lucky if you don't trip over a skeever instead. Look, I know the others think I'm a bit dull for saying stuff like something out there is piss drunk mad at us. I don't know who or what it is, but it's beyond just you and me. We've been cursed. Mm. Okay. I'll tell you what we do. We spit in that curse's face and turn fit. That's where you come in. I've got plenty of work available that could guide us down the road to recover it. All you need to do is ask, and we can both come out of this smelling like a rose. Watch yourself out there. The mercenaries are in Goff Hire to train killers. Just ask off. I handle the fishing. If break-ins are more your thing, go talk to Vex. Most of the step, your job, we'll like doing a bit of writing. Yeah, sure. Keep this up, and you'll be rich enough to retire it's before you know it. It's one thing to say you've got the skills to be a thief. Another to actually use them. All right. Um, 
Oh, it's here in Riften. That's a good thing. So, yeah, we're going to do all that stuff in the next part. Hope you guys liked it. I'm going to quick save and I'm going to bed here because it's pretty late already. So, thanks for watching and hope to see you at one of the next parts. Take care and bye-bye.